things up and let's go because they still have an opportunity to make things happen. Shake it off. And he'll be brought down right at the 30 here. Seven yards there and a first down. So first and 10 now from the 30. They'll run it with Johnson. Set the tone, defense. Let's go. And he'll slip his way up across the 30 to the 32. Throwing on second and eight. Falls. This short throw caught by Goddard. Eight yards on the completion, but now they face third down. On third down, Johnson. And he's got the first down yardage before he's brought down at the 42. And now we won't see a play on first down. We're going to get a timeout instead. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. Here's Foles. And that is incomplete. He couldn't hold on through the contact. Brings yeah. up second down. The beauty of being able to play a zone defense when you can sit back and see the ball coming out of the quarterback's hands, guess what? Creates a lot of confusion. Kind of a muddle in the middle of the field where you can go make a play on the football. A second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. It's a lot of contact going on there, and in the end, unable to keep two hands on the football and bring it into his body. Everything looked pretty good until the finish. And the reception made by Alshon Jeffrey. Well, this is going to depend on the spot, but it's not a very generous one. He looks to be about a yard or so short. So much about offense is what we did a really nice job there of limiting that and keeping him from a first down. Yeah, stopped him in his tracks. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. First carry for James Conner. He takes it down to the 42, a five-yard run. Hey, watch that, watch that. Check Mike 54. Mike 54. It's our time. It's our time. One, 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 one. Second and five now. Fools. You ain't doing nothing today. And is this intercepted? It is. It's intercepted. Cheetah Bay Awuzie with a pick. And he's able to get it back to the 41 yard line. That's a pick, boy. That's a pick. Going the other way. Brandon, this is a real nice job defensively of getting inside a quarterback's head and figuring out, okay, where is he going with the football? Because you can make an educated guess defensively, not all the time, but sometimes, and when you're right, you've got a decent chance of coming away with the football. Now a play fake here on first down. The Eagles will take their third and final timeout. And with that, they're now out of timeouts. There's still plenty of time remaining here in this second quarter. And they need to work to at least get some of this yardage back after the sack. Second and 19. They play fake to Elliott. Now Prescott. Toward the left sideline, but it's incomplete. 158 left to play till we hit halftime. We remind you, as we've done all year, that coming up at halftime, we will visit with Jonathan Coachman standing by in Orlando. He'll let you know what's going on here on a very eventful divisional round weekend. Just a two-yard pickup, and that should necessitate a call for the punt team here on fourth down. We often talk of situational football. Let's just call it team football. The defense did their job, got off the field, brought the punting situation, so they're turning the ball back over to their offense. You think those guys will get along very well right now? Of course they will. Defense helped the offense. Now it's their turn to take it downfield. Nick Foles gearing up again here to go on offense. He's got to dig deep here, doesn't he? Team's losing. He's not playing well either. And they always tell you, don't press. You'll make things a little bit worse. But in this particular situation, you try and heighten your play a little bit. So far, he's pretty to get his team back moving forward. Looking to throw again on second down. Foles. And mark him down way up close to the 40 at the 39. A gain there of 21 yards. Going for Metcalf on the deep ball. And he knocks the ball away, and it falls incomplete. The Notre Dame man, Jalen Smith, able to get a hand in and knock it away. 
This defense has been very disruptive early on as they force another one to go awry. Seems to be the front and the back end. Pass rush, they've been able to get home, and they're taking the ball away in coverage as well. I love how you put it together. The front and back working in sync. Only way to play good defense. They'll tussle for it, and this is going to be caught. A game there of 30 big ones. So we've come upon halftime here in this NFC Divisional Round matchup. As we'll send you down the coast now to Orlando, that's where we find Jonathan Coachman ready with our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach. Okay, Brandon, thanks very much. This fourth and final matchup on this Divisional Round weekend. We'll get back to you guys in just a moment. But first, let's take a look back to Saturday's NFC Divisional Round game. And it's the Seattle Seahawks who are moving on to the next round as they eliminate the Chicago Bears. Meanwhile, in our game, we're set up for a terrific second half. So to find out who will advance to the NFC title game, let's send it back out to Brandon God. Okay, coach, appreciate it. A one time. Touchdown game here as we get set to resume play in the second half. A trip to the NFC title game hanging in the ballot. Second half action back underway. This one taken just inside the 10. And nice work on the return as they'll start their drive just past the 30-yard line. Out come the Eagles now as they'll go on offense first here in the third quarter. They're down here, but very much in this game. What, what's the tonality of a coach's talk when a game is within striking check distance cross, like this cross, at intermission? Check cross, check Typically, 52. what they're doing is emphasizing the things that went well in the first half and wanting more of that. Sure, you've got to go over some of the errors and clean up some things because there's a reason you're down. But overall, I think they want to stay positive, stay up with this team. We're just starting the second half, and we've got the football. Let's go ahead and punch it in, and then we'll take it from there. See how that recipe works. Now falls. It's brought in by Jeffrey. And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. To throw again on second down. Foles. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. Foles. And that's complete to Jeffrey. So from Cowboy territory now, here's first and 10 at the 47. Now Johnson, and they're going to get him behind the line yet again as his nightmare afternoon continues. Alec Ogletree in on the stop. They go to Johnson again. And this time not as successful as he'll get back to the line of scrimmage and no more. They'll say no gain on the play there, and now it'll be third down. Play number seven now coming up on the drive. Third and five. Back to throw here. And that is incomplete. The Notre Dame man, Jalen Smith, able to get a hand in and knock it away. Not only was the call spot on, how about the execution of that defense right there? The zone was absolutely locked up tight. He was trying to force it in there on third down. But if there's a time to force it, he felt like he needed to make a play, right? Yeah, exactly right. Third down, you got to try and find something. There's nothing available there for him. So a decent drive there to start the third quarter. They only salvaged three out of it, but they inch a bit closer. Yeah, but still lots of time to go in this one. That's why you hear that clapping on the sidelines, <laughs> right? Hey, got some points. As you said, inching their way back in. Time left to go out and get that victory. The Cowboys offense now, they head out for their first possession of the second half. And a tight game after punting last time. See if they can get something going on this drive. As they head to the field now, with the game this close, you've got to feel there's a sense of urgency for them going on offense right now. But they have to do it without letting panic creep in and affect their play. 
On second and 11 now. Prescott got an open man. It's Michael Gallup. His first reception of the divisional round matchup, but it's good for a first down as well. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Out of the gun, it's Elliott. And this will be stopped at the 44. That one good for seven yards. Despite the blitz, they're still able to pick up a nice, solid gain. The disadvantage of blitzing often alters the normal spacing and run fits and leaves creases like they were able to exploit right there. This is Elliott. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Off play action to Elliott. Here's Prescott. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Ryan Kerrigan able to get in there for his second sack of the afternoon. Out now comes the Cowboys punter as he'll come on to kick this one away. And a nice special teams job here. This is going to be down inside on, the 10 at the 7-yard line. One quarter remains for a trip to the NFC title game. And that'll do it for the end of the second quarter. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. He's going to have the first down past the 20. And finally taken down to the 25-yard line. A big pickup there for the Eagles' first down, 18 yards. They definitely see some open running lanes, and he's taking advantage of it right now, but that shouldn't be a surprise. Right there. Defense has the right lead. There. Right there. They're, They're playing for the pass mind. first. They'll look to throw here on first down. And nowhere to fit that football in. It's knocked away and incomplete. The Notre Dame man, Jalen Smith, able to get a hand in and knock it away. An incomplete pass leads to second and 10 from the 25. Second and 10. And they've got the hookup. This is Olsen. And from the 25, they work this to the 29, a gain of four. That'll be a pickup of four as they work with his four-point fourth-quarter lead. Oh, he's got a man wide open, complete. The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts. That'll leave them with two remaining. We'll be back after this. Foles now perfect since the second half started. Seven of seven. It's first and ten. They give to Johnson going right. And three yards there takes him to the 45. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Again, it's Johnson. A one-yard gain there following the three-yard pickup on first down. One of the bigger plays in the game thus far. The crowd getting into it as we come up on a big third down. Under, 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 under. They'll look to throw. And that's knocked away and incomplete. And we just saw another example. These cornerbacks have played tight coverage all game long. Might start wanting to think about a few double, triple move routes to try and shake their guys free. They have, you're right, they have had no room to breathe. Got to try it here. He's back to throw. And shedding through the tackle. Going for Metcalf on the deep ball. And no, it's incomplete. The Eagles on, unable to convert there on fourth. And Dallas, they'll take over in terrific field position. Well, being just short of midfield, they decide to take a crack at it on fourth down. They don't come through. Sometimes it's just showing confidence in your defense. You know that they're good, and they'll take care of you. A lot of coaches during the week will announce to their team, we're going to be aggressive, guys. We're going to go for it. Hey, defense, you got me? <laughs> A little bit of a challenge to them to see if they'll pick up the rest of the team. Let's see how they respond now. A first down carry by Elliott. And the reinforcements come in as they're going to stop him behind the line. Now the Eagles will use the second of their timeouts. That's going to be their second. They'll be left with one more plus the two-minute warning. And we'll be back. On play action, Prescott. Oh, no, he lost the football. And it's picked up by the Eagles. 20, 10. And he'll score. Touchdown, Eagles. 
And a big turning point here in the second half, Charles, after that play. All you're trying to do is change momentum.